Start tonight down on the shores of the Niagara River where two people are still missing hours after they went into the water. Good evening, I'm Mary Alice Demler. And hello everyone, I'm Scott Levin. Search teams have been down at Broderick Park on Unity Island throughout the day and that is where Two On Your Side's Ron Plants joins us live tonight. Ron? Scott, Mary Alice, uh, it seems kind of strange to say with this beautiful day here at Broderick Park, but this beautiful setting was actually marred by tragedy earlier this morning about 7 o'clock when two people indeed did go missing here in the river. They are still missing at this point. And you can see behind me, that is a swift moving river, about 20 feet of water right there at this point. Now, this search, including police divers, has been underway uh, since early this morning. As we mentioned, 7 o'clock, the reports came in. Two people were seen struggling in the water here. Agencies, including the Erie County Sheriff's Office, Coast Guard and others with boats, as well as the Air One helicopter, and even cadaver dogs on shore down river here have all been part of that search. Police say this began, as you were pointing out, with a strange incident, a vehicle crashing through a railing into the water here at the park. It was picked up on a nearby surveillance camera. Police still investigating that, and so far no motive for us at this point. That railing now repaired, but the search ongoing. And one fisherman telling me he's haunted by what he saw this morning with that one person, at least one person struggling in the water. I thought you'd scream or yell more, but he was just really had to help twice and then silently just went down there. I'm down here all the time. That's yeah, it's very, very peaceful. That's why I come down here. So. It's very, very disturbing to see. Looking over my shoulder there, down river towards the International uh, Railroad Bridge, you may be able to see police boats down there still searching in that area and also near the foot of Ontario Street. I'm told by police that that search will probably continue until at least nightfall and then they'll reassess. And one question that may be coming up for some folks, what about life preservers? Were there any here? We're going to have more on that coming up on Channel 2 News at 6. Reporting live from Broderick Park in Buffalo, I'm Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.